Okay, so hey everybody, I'm gonna start out with this brown gel liner. This is just a generic brown gel eyeliner. And I'm using this as a base because it's long wearing and it will also serve as my crease color. I'm going to apply a concealer on top of that just to act as a sticky base for my gold eyeshadow that we'll apply later on. Next, moving on to my transition colors, I'm using a maroon and a burnt orange type rusty shade. And now I'm going to apply a gold shimmery eyeshadow to my lid. You could skip the next step, which is the gold holographic glitter, and move on to just eyeliner. But here I'm using the e.l.f. eyelash glue to apply my glitter because I wouldn't use it to apply my eyelashes and I just had it sitting around so I decided to use it up for this purpose. Next I'm taking Max Black Track Fluid Line and just giving myself a thinner winged eyeliner and I just preferred using the gel eyeliner as opposed to a liquid over top the glitter. Yeah, this is taking a while. I decided not to speed this up too much just because I wanted you to see how I'm actually doing the eyeliner. Next, I'm moving on to a metallic gunmetal shimmery eyeliner pencil on the waterline just because I didn't want a full on black. Next, I'm using a full on black underneath the waterline just on my lower lash line. And I'm going to use the transition shades just to blend out the black eyeliner so it's not as harsh. Next, so I'm going to take the concealer that I put on top of my lid. I'm going to use it underneath my eyes just to kind of highlight and conceal any dark circles and also to clean the look up. I'm placing that on other highlighty type areas, so the top of my nose, my forehead, my chin. Now I'm going ahead and applying a translucent powder to the areas that I applied my concealer. And by the way, the names of the products that I'm using are on the screen, so just look out for that. Next, I'm going to use a powder that is my shade, my correct shade, and just blend out the translucent powder that I have on my face and also set the foundation that I have on. I had already gone ahead and applied my false eyelashes off camera, so that's what you're seeing here. Next, I'm just contouring with a dark brown eyeshadow. Nothing special. If you want to learn more, then just go ahead and watch any highlighting or contouring video on YouTube. Next, I'm applying a blush to my cheeks. This is a blush that I made at home, so it's not something you can buy in stores. Uh, but it's just really a dusty rose shimmer shade I'm gonna take the shimmery gold shades and put that on the top of my cheeks and on down the bridge of my nose just blended that out and I'm applying my lip balm to my lips to prep them for the lipstick application Next, I'm applying a bright orange. It's just called Orange, and it's by a local brand called Tura Cosmetics. It's based in Jamaica, so you can only get it here. I'm not sure if you can get it in the States. 
because they don't have a website and I'm using Jordan that's orange right on top I didn't feel like going nude with the lips you could if you chose to but as you can see here I use coral and also a deep plum color called cyber by Mac thank you guys for watching I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope it was helpful bye